the Amy's. We're here with a special Valentine's edition of our reviews. Since love is in the air, we thought we'd go to two romantic comedies, including Safe Haven and It's a Good Day to Die Hard. And up first, for all of you ladies, we are reviewing It's a Good Day to Die Hard. Mm-hmm. I mean, look at that man candy, huh? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna critique this movie too much, but if I have one thing to say, it's that it could have used more violence. Yes. We appreciate the subtlety yeah. of what they were doing, yeah. but I really feel like they maybe could have pushed it a little bit more. Just take it further. Mm -hmm. If there's a dead horse, just beat, beat it, it a little longer. Beat it. Men of the world, why does it take a Russian terror plot to get you to talk to your kids? Just talk to your kids. Hang out. Play some ball in the backyard. Okay? Kids are really tough to raise. Uh, because if you're not yelling at them to do their homework, then you're flying to Russia to help break them out of prison after they assassinated a high-ranking official. 007 of Plainfield, New Jersey. Relax, you're safe now. No, you're not. You're in Russia. There's nothing safe about Russia. It's like the worst place on Earth. Except for the Bolshoi. Oh, oh God. Those dancers are transcendental. Stalin's still alive, right? Mm hmm Still ruling with that iron fist? Yep. Thank God that that woman was there to do whatever it was she did. I liked that monologue that she didn't have. Mm-hmm. Yes. It's called post-feminism. Bruce Willis actually refused to memorize any dialogue for this movie and just stuck strictly to catchphrases, mm -hmm. which didn't really change the movie all that much. Dad, what did you come to Russia for? yippee ki yay motherfucker! All right, Dad, we got terrorists over there, we got snipers up on the roof, what should we do? Yippee ki yay Listen, Dad, I'm in the CIA now. I could have done this myself. yippee ki yay mother All right. yippee ki yay Motherfucker. You go looking for trouble, or does it always find you? I still ask myself the same question. And gentlemen, we're not leaving you out of the Valentine's Day festivities because we're here with our review of Safe Haven. I mean, say what you will about films that are adapted from Nicholas Sparks novels, but mm -hmm. these characters had names. Yeah. This had a location. Right. It had a plot line. Uh -huh. They changed scenes. Yeah. It had it all. Yeah. It had the components that make a film. Right. The last time that I jumped on a random city bus, it did not drop me off in the middle of a sleepy coastal town. I got tattooed, lost my memory, lost my wallet. This movie makes no sense. She's running from an abusive ex. He's a widower with two kids. I mean, if these two can't find love, then that actually makes a lot of sense because those really aren't ideal situations right. for anybody. Why won't you let him get to know you? I've had things happen to me in the past. Oh. Hey, way to be discreet about your checkered past. Yeah. You don't want people to ask questions about don't where ask. you came from. Maybe don't act all cryptic about where you came from. Yeah, I was a little turned off by how turned on she was when she found out he was a widower. Yeah. She was saying no, 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 and then the lady's like, Did you hear about his wife? She passed away a few years ago. And she's like, well, my stars. Oh my goodness. I guess I'll go canoeing with you, good <laughs> sir. And you heard about his son, right? He has ADHD, they had to put him on Ritalin. And you heard about his reading skills, right? He reads at a fifth grade level. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You heard about his penis, right? Mm-hmm. It tilts to the left a little bit. I mean, we've all seen it. You'll see it, too. There's no safer place for you than here with me. Amy's review time. All right, everybody, we've concluded that the movie you are going to fall in love with this Valentine's Day is Die Safe Hard Haven. 5. Oh my god, we don't agree. Hey, everybody, we're the Amy. <laughs> <laughs> we pluralize a plural. Hey, everybody. Hey, everybody. Thanks for joining us. <laughs> <laughs>